Hi, my name is Sam Schlishman. I'm an emergency room physician here at 29 Palms Military Base. I'm here with Lieutenant Welch and Corman Brackens. We're here to demonstrate a new way to dispense children's acetaminophen and ibuprofen. I guarantee somewhere out there there's a mother who's suffering with a child who has a fever and um, is very likely underdosing with acetaminophen or ibuprofen. So the fever is probably going to stay high Potentially, the mother will call a hotline and be instructed to come to the emergency department. When mom and child come to the emergency department, we will give a higher dose of either drug. The child will be sent to the emergency department waiting room where they may infect other patients. By the time I see the patient, uh, very likely the fever will be down. Mom will be happy and the kid will be discharged with a diagnosis of viral syndrome. So I thought we'd demonstrate how we dose acetaminophen and ibuprofen currently, followed by a, a new technique. Go ahead. Okay, well. so uh, given a 10 kilogram child, we kind of start off with kind of a laborious set of mathematical calculations that we go through to determine the correct dosage. The dose that we, uh, we give Tylenol is 15 megs per kilogram. So given 10 kilogram child, we'll multiply uh, 10 times 15. That gives us a required dose of 150 milligrams. And then we look at the concentration of our medication in our bottle, and it reads that we have 160 milligrams per 5 ml. So given that information, we can set it up as a cross-cancellation mathematical problem. 160 milligrams per 5 ml. 150 milligrams, and we're trying to determine the number of milliliters that we need to drop in a syringe. So we cross-multiply, and we can divide it out. And if we round up, we come to 4.7 mLs. So now we can draw up our medication. Okay, a little over, so I'll push a little bit out. And there we have it. 4.7 mLs. Thanks very much. Now, Carmen Brackens can show us a different technique. Do. Okay, so you might not have enough time to do all the calculations and get all that figured out. Easy way to get the 10 kilograms is these little labels here, which you know can be either be picked up off offline or you know through extra oh, copies or online. First, all you do is just take it off. Line up with the syringe. Okay. And then pull up our tin. There you have it. No frustrations, no calculation errors, and quick and easy. Thanks very much, Carmen. So these documents are going to be available for free online, and I hope it uh, saves a few trips to the emergency department.